Well, hello. It's been, let's just say, a stressful day so far. I've, I was commentating over in um, Leeds at the Poppy Run at Middleton Park. Got a flat tyre as I left the park. And I thought, am I going to get to the, the match? Uh, and thanks to Johnny from Halifax, who I was working with this morning. Johnny, you've got YouTube fame now because you uh, helped me. So, well, actually, you just did uh, jack up my uh, tyre and sort it out. So, thank you, Johnny. Uh, Eric, what's your prediction for Forest Green Rovers this afternoon? I'd love to say a win today, but I'm saying 2 on to Forest Green. 2 1 to Forest Green. And he calls me when I'm negative, but are you, are you not feeling it today? They're top of the league. Well, they are top of the league. All right, I will be the one with optimism today. Home, home advantage, um, and um, we got. Um, uh, we got a result last uh, last weekend. Sorry, that's the noise of the bus in the background. I think we're going to win 1 0. Sorry, tough game. I'm going to go for 1 0 Bradford. So there's my prediction. We are a bit last minute today. I've just had a steak bake on the way up the hill from. Yeah, either 2 2 or 2 1 to Boris Green. I don't think we're going to win, but a draw is possible. Well, let's see what happens. Let's get to the ground no, not far we, away now. If we win, I'll be virtually. Oh my god, I don't know when I'll be like, you'll see when we sign off. <laughs> What did you think of the first half then? Forest Green had most of the possession, Great. but it's goals that matter. I think they were trying for a few free kicks, weren't they? They're just treats. But like, what? That just on the joke of my fan, Levy Sutton is clean for a goal and he gets taken down. It's outside the box, but if the Forest Green player didn't do that, we would have got a second. But you know what? We're beating top of the league and we're up to 10th as it stands at the minute. You can see the players. Uh, some of the Forest Green players are, are out warming up at the moment and some of the Bradford players are as well. It's lovely and sunny, the rain seems to have stopped and a great view uh, from this side of, 
uh, the stand that we're normally in as well. Right. Oh. Oh, for a corner, 1-1 on the start. board, 25 minutes to go. Oh, a tumble in the box. Uh, ten minutes left. Is there going to be another goal? I really don't know. It's one one. It's very very tense. The uh, We've got a chance here. Bradford Stay on. In Forest Green's half near the Bradford lift stand, uh, drawing near the Forest Green yeah. fans. We've just got back now. We have just got back. 1-1, one, one, fair result, do you think? I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think we played better in the first half, uh, but we certainly didn't get any help from the referee. Was it a penalty in those dying minutes? You, you're convinced it was. We'll have to wait for the... Um... No, there's literally 30 seconds left. Well, you know, the, I th sometimes things look worse from the stand, and that's what the gentleman who sits next to me says. He says, sometimes, you know, when, when you sort of play, it's easy to kind of, you know, think that... You know, we were robbed and things like that. I don't know. Yeah, we were robbed. Well, all I'll know is that Eric is going to the FA Cup game next week. Uh, I'm not. I'm in Newcastle. So um, you're hoping to get some footage, but it'll be from a different view. So if it is, you have I to watch out know. for that. Right, see you later. Have a good one. Bye for now. Oh, no.